treatment towards women. The key to maintaining a strong relationship with your woman is to let go of that controlling mindset. It's all about having a clear sense of purpose in your own life, showing respect and being confident. Believe me, if you're successful in your own endeavors and treat her well, she'll be fully committed. However, if you neglect your personal growth and put her needs above everything else, you're setting yourself up for problems. No woman wants to be the sole focus of your life. They desire a man with strength of character, shade ambitions, and the determination to achieve them. If you want to keep your woman happy and engaged, it's crucial to maintain that strong, confident exterior. Women are attracted to men who are emotionally resilient and composed, not those who constantly display their vulnerabilities. So, no matter how much you might be hurting inside, keep that composed demeanor and save the emotional moments for when you're alone or with your close friends. I understand it can be challenging, but remember that women have been conditioned to see men as emotionally stable and dependable. Demonstrate your inner strength and control your emotions. And if you really need to express yourself or find support, lean on your friends and have those heart-to-heart -heart conversations with them. They'll understand. I've learned these lessons through experience, and now I'm passing on this wisdom to you. Take charge of your life, be the confident, emotionally composed man that women desire, and watch your relationships flourish. Relationship advice. Listen, I'm no relationship expert, but I've picked up a thing or two about the intricacies of women and their dynamics in relationships. If you open up too much to a woman, she might start seeing you as more of a therapist than a romantic partner. Let's face it, no one really wants to date their therapist. Believe me, I've seen this happen more times than I can count. As for hypogamy, it's like trying to catch a greased pig at a county fair. You might think you've got a solid grip, but she'll slip right through your fingers. And if by some miracle you do manage to catch her, you might discover she's a wild one, not interested in settling down. It's a risky game to play, my friend. It's time to have a candid discussion about women and relationships. You see, a significant number of women are primarily interested in short-term flings. If you're entertaining the idea of marrying one of them, well, you might be setting yourself up for a world of heartache. Let's be honest here, many women have endured the hardships of being mistreated by those so-called bad boys. Yet, against all reason, some men still pursue them. Frankly, that's a bit foolhardy. Moreover, it's unfortunate that after facing such mistreatment, some women emerge from these relationships emotionally scarred, and even more regrettably, with a disdain for men. It's a grim reality. And don't fall for the myth that marriage miraculously transforms them into obedient, respectful wives. Those college girls who've had their fair share of fun can turn out to be some of the most cunning players, preying on those unsuspecting beta guys who believe that their stable jobs and salaries will make them irresistibly attractive. Hypogamy. You see, many women end up settling for the seemingly unimpressive, nice guy who takes care of all their financial needs, but deep down, they secretly yearn for that unpredictable bad boy who mirrors the chaos of their past. It's an unfortunate truth. Let's not forget those women who believe they're entitled to the top 1% of men simply because they possess physical beauty. They may have legions of admirers, particularly those we might colloquially call simps, but in reality, Many lack moral values, true femininity, and genuine respect for men. In fact, these women act like men, and unless you want to date men, what exactly are you doing around them? At the end of the day, it all boils down to two primary factors. The drama and emotional roller coaster that alpha males provide, and the financial stability that beta males bring to the table. If a man fails to bring something substantial to the relationship, a woman might very well resent him for it. That's just the way the cookie crumbles. So, don't delude yourself into thinking you're her one and only. There will always be someone out there with more money, power, and allure. It's high time you wake up, seize control of your life, and become the best version of yourself. That's the only way to thrive in this intricate game we call life. Fellas, here's a truth bomb that might hit you like a ton of bricks, no matter how much you do for your woman. Regardless of how long you've been together, when the dust settles, 
her primal instincts are going to kick in. She'll start scanning the horizon for the next big, bad, and wealthy player on the scene. It's just biology, guys. How to be the Sigma Marley. Now, I get it. This might sound like a harsh reality check, but you've got to toughen up and face the music. Don't spill your guts or show any signs of weakness. Keep that game face on, stay laser focused on your goals, and never put her on a pedestal. And if, despite all your efforts, she decides to walk away or, heaven forbid, cheat on you, don't crumble into a sobbing mess in the corner. Just remember, she was never truly yours from the start. Picture this, guys. You've been grinding away, leveling up in your career, hitting the gym, and constantly striving to be the best version of yourself. You've got a great woman by your side, and you think everything is going perfectly. You're providing, you're attentive, and you're loyal. But then, one day, you start noticing some changes in her behavior. She's been spending more time on her phone, seemingly lost in conversations with someone. She's been going out more often with her friends, and you can't shake the feeling that something's off. Instead of falling into the trap of pouring your heart out to her, you decide to play it cool. You don't confront her with baseless accusations or show any signs of insecurity. Instead, you double down on your own ambitions and your own goals. You keep hitting the gym, working on your projects, and hanging out with your friends. One evening, she drops a bombshell. She tells you that she's met someone else, someone she finds exciting and new. It stings, no doubt about it. But here's where your months of leveling up pay off. You don't crumble into a sobbing mess. You don't beg her to stay. You don't give her the satisfaction of seeing you broken. Instead, you look her in the eyes and say, I wish you the best, with a calm and collected demeanor. You understand that her primal instincts have led her to seek novelty. It's just biology, and you're not about to let it break you. In the days that follow, you pick up the pieces, refocus your energy, and keep pushing forward. You know that your life's journey is about you and your growth. She was just a passenger for a while, and now she's on a different route. That's okay because you're the one driving your own destiny. So, fellas, remember, in the grand game of life, you're the main character. Keep upgrading, keep striving, and never let anyone else dictate your happiness or worth. It's time to embrace your inner strength and man up. And that's it for today on Sigma Traits. Make sure you hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, and don't forget to ring that notification bell so you can be the first to know when my new video drops. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. See you all tomorrow.